Welcome to another video and today we are going to be looking at a wonderful tool, a very powerful tool which is going to permit us to get the web design of any website which is publicly available. So I'll send you to Figma, you can go to the website figma.com and if you don't know what Figma is, essentially it's a mock-up website where you get to design your website before it's being created. So you get to design how you want your website to look and you create essentially a blueprint of your website. So that's what we Figma permits you to do. And so if you head on to Figma, you create an account and you log in, you're going to be presented with this interface. And so what you want to do is go to new design. And so it's going to take you into this interface where you have different elements which are going to permit you to create the design of your website. So you have squares, you have text and different other elements which are part of websites. So we are not going to be creating a mockup today, but I want to show you instead a plugin which is going to permit you to get the mockup of any website out there. So every website it has a template from which it was built. And so we are going to be extracting the elements of the different websites and essentially creating a template from them. So you want to come here to this button and then navigate to plugins. And on plugins, you want to come here from find more plugins. And then you search for HTML to design. And so once it's there, you click on it and you run it. And now you're going to get this little pop-up that will appear and inside this input box you can enter the url of any website you would like to clone so you can really put in anything and if it's available online it's going to extract the website and it's going to present to you with the mockup so we're just going to take any random website out there for example jimia.cm which is a, a an e-commerce website so we're going to, going to import it here and so it's going to take a little while while it's importing all of the elements and so it's important equally to mention that it isn't it isn't just taking a snapshot of the website no it's it's actually extracting each individual element to make them interactable so you're going to be able to interact with each and every element edit them displace them and really position them as you want so after a little while now it has imported that website so you can now close this pop-up and as you can see we have the exact replica of the jumia website jumia.cm if you go to jumia.cm you're going to see that it's very much the same and so here you have all of the elements and you can click on them to interact with them so you can select for example a text and you get to modify it you have to double click to be able to select the particular text and so it's going to take you into the subsequent layers in which the text is found So as you click, you see the square box reducing as it is trying to enter the specific element you have chosen. So now if we double click again, it's going to take us where we need to be. And so now we double click. And so it brings us now to this element that we can easily edit. So if we select this, so we can change the text. So you see it has changed that line of text and so this really permits us to edit every aspect of this website so we can on the basis of another website we can edit it and change it to come up with our own version of our website so if there's any website out there that you like the design and you appreciate it and you want to replicate it you can use this wonderful plugin to do just that and so let's go ahead and try something else we are going to scroll on the sidebar the left sidebar and then we're going to fold this and just make it invisible for now. And then we're going to try to import another website. So any website with a URL can be imported here. So you're going to click on the plugin once more and you're going to, it's going to appear the pop-up and they are going to enter the link to that website. So, so let's try another website, nextdimempire.com. And so it's going to import as well this popular block and it's going to really put every element. So let's give it some time while it's working. It's going to be importing each element. It gets the images, it gets the text, it gets the fonts, and it gets really everything that is found on the website as it is. And from those bases now you can develop whatever template you want. So it's really a very powerful tool. So if there's any website out there that you want to see the design, you appreciate the design and you want to copy that, you can easily use this tool to get that.
So now after a while now it's done, we can now close the pop-up once more and you can see at the back we have our website. So we're going to zoom out a little bit. So you can see now this block, it has gotten all the elements as they are. So it's very wonderful. This plugin is real powerful. So it gets everything as it is. The images, it detects the images, it detects the text, and it really brings all of them out here to permit you to edit them. So as you can see, this is a text here. I can go ahead and change the text to whatever I like just by double clicking. So as you can see, it's wonderful. So it's really interactive and i really appreciate that so this is a wonderful tool and there are equally as well plugins which permit you to convert this your mockup design into full websites so as you can see not only can you easily copy the mockup of a website but you can as well convert that into a website and essentially make it a clone of that website so it's a wonderful tool and so let's go ahead and try one last website because i appreciate this plugin so much i just constantly use it to just be exploring different elements different websites and getting your mockups from there so we are going to go ahead on the sidebar we're going to go ahead and reduce this and make it invisible we go ahead and call our plugin once more and then let's import another website that i appreciate very much dribble.com So we'll give it some time for it to import all of the elements. So as you can see, you can discover now the power of this wonderful plugin. So it has imported the website dribble.com and you can see all of the elements which have appeared. It's just identical to the website. So it's very wonderful. It's impressive and it's amazing. And so from now on this basis, you can go ahead and design whatever website you like, whatever personal website you are trying to design based off of the design maybe of another website, you can easily do it from here. Like I said, all of the elements are editable, the images are present, the little icons are present, everything has been imported as it should be. So this is a very wonderful plugin and it does some amazing work. So definitely I recommend that you check it out and you're going to be amazed by it. So hopefully you enjoyed the video. Catch you on the next one.